Hey guys, Cha Chan here. In today's video, I had no idea what to draw, and I also had zero motivation to draw anything. <laughs> so I drew Billy, and I drew him looking kind of fed up, and I also decided to do my kind of lazy line art. <laughs> I mean, no, it's totally stylized because um, I, I wasn't being lazy, and the line art is wonky on purpose, yes. Well, actually, the, the line art is wonky on purpose, but it is also because I was lazy. <laughs> right, I've used this style before to draw my um, Yu-Gi-Oh fan art that I posted a speed paint of a while back, a few months, a couple months ago. Uh, I think it's titled I Don't Remember because it's kind of edgy and it's based on the um, Season Zero side of things. Anyway, you go, go watch that video if you want to see some cool artwork. I didn't talk in that one, but I'm talking in this one because, uh, why not? <laughs> anyway, it is almost Christmas. In fact, I think this is the last video I post before Christmas, and then the next one will be on the 27th. No, sorry, that's completely wrong. 28th. <laughs> um, so, Merry Christmas if you celebrate. Happy Holidays if you celebrate something else, or don't celebrate at all. Just have a nice time. Anyway, uh, what can I say about this artwork? Um, as I said, lazy line art. As you can see, I'm just kind of doing wonky, wonky lines. Honestly, I don't mind the style. I think maybe it. I could have done something else to make it suit this image a bit more. Like, the wonky lines, it looks good when you do it to the whole image, but it's kind of... <laughs> Uh, what 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 would you say? It's it's walking on a line. Is that the phrase? That doesn't sound like the phrase. It's uh, got a thin line between looking stylized and looking bad, and um, it's a difficult line to walk along. <laughs> so <laughs> hopefully, I got the right uh, like style across in this image. I don't know. I don't know. I think maybe I could have worked with the atmosphere a bit more, like I did with my Yu-Gi-Oh fan art. I purposefully went, you know, the line art should look unsteady because Yu-Gi's like got a concussion and whatever. In this one I don't really know what I was doing, I just kind of couldn't be bothered to draw anything. <laughs> it's a Tuesday night, my videos go up on Wednesday, so that's why I'm kind of rushing to do something. Um, when I draw these kind of wonky line art things, I like to add some chromatic aberration, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, because it just, uh, it disguises how lazy I was being, but also it does add some atmosphere to the image. So, there's that, you all see that in the end. Uh, I was going to add some, like, static over this, but I just didn't really like the look of it, so didn't add it in the end. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think that's about everything about this drawing. It's very lazy. <laughs> it has been a while since I've done any DTMG fan art actually. I don't know when the last uh, Dude That's My Ghost video was. It might have actually been when I did the uh, the fan made art book where I compiled all of the concept art I could find about the show. Backgrounds and concept and everything. And then I wrote like a, a few pages of information about the show. Yeah, that was a fun project. I have not continued it since then. I maybe should. It would be kind of fun. Though I am kind of considering, like vaguely considering doing one for RC9GN, Randy Cunningham, 9th Grade Ninja, because uh, I think that would be a fun project as well. But uh, the art for that's a lot easier to find, and the problem with that is that it's really difficult picking and choosing which images to use, whereas with Dude That's My Ghost it was like, oh, there's like the initial concept, and oh, here's the like character turnaround from various stages of production. It was very limited in what we had, whereas with RC9GN you have everything. Literally everything is out there. So it's really difficult to choose what you want to like pick out to put in an art book. <laughs> so uh, yeah. Anyway, that was a whole ramble about who knows what. Uh, yeah. Alright, what else is going on? Well, it's almost Christmas, so I'm taking time off my fursuit work. 
I say as I continue to make fursuit projects. <laughs> I started making like a Kikidumi anime gal style uh, fursuit head. I've sculpted the foam face, I quite like it. Now I have to decide what I want to do like design wise for the character, so that's my next project. Uh, I'm also working on a anime figure custom which is currently on my desk in the middle of being put back together. I have a lot of work to do on that. <laughs> anyway, here we are, kind of end of the video. Uh, I've rambled on long enough. I hope you like this very lazy artwork that I've done. I think it looks alright. It's okay. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please do not hit the like button as that probably hurts and not very nice, so maybe shake his hand instead. With that being said, I hope to see you in the next one, and bye!